Hi, Lori here to take you through the <clears throat> present value of a stream of payments. We're going to take a look at what Aunt Mabel has decided to do. She's chucked her will. She's decided to give away all her money over the next five years. And you're going to get $20,000 per year for the next five years. Pretty darn good. What is the present value of that total gift? Um, and let's assume the discount rate is 8%. Well, we can use our present value formula for this because we have a series of equal payments so this will work. Our rate is 0.08, our number of periods is 5, our payments are $20,000 per year, and our future value is 0, close print and hit it. Now you'll notice that it came out as a negative, as red, and in parenthesis, and that's because it's um, telling you, Excel is telling you what you would have to invest now at 8%, what, you, what your outflow, which is why it's negative, would have to be now at 8% in, able, in order to generate five years of payments at $20,000 per year. If you don't like the negative sign, and frankly I don't myself like it, I just put a negative sign at the beginning of my formula, which is right here, the negative PV. So let's go ahead and copy our formula down. We'll paste it right in here. And we'll go in and just put a negative and sign in front of it. And voila, we get it to be the sign we want it to. Um, and that tells us that the stream of $20,000 per year for five years is worth at 8% interest $79,854.20. Now, Let's tackle our second question. What if Aunt Mabel has decided to give out different amounts every year? She's going to give us 10,000 in year one, 15,000 in year two, 20,000 in year three, 25,000 in year four, and 30,000 in year five. Let's add that up and make sure that it does add up to $100,000 because that's what she intends to give us. And we're going to lay it out in a table here. First of all, we've got a year, one, two, three, four, and five. And then we've got a column for the amount being paid in that year. And that is your future value. Your present value of each gift can be calculated using our present value formula. So equals PV, parenthesis, the rate is 0.08, the nu number of periods in this particular case, it's 1, so we can pick it up by simply going over and highlighting that. The payment itself is 0, because we're not having equal payments over time. We're having a single payment, so we're going to put a 0 there. And then it wants us to put in the future value as a negative number, so we'll put in negative. And then our future value, remember, is this column right here. And we can just highlight it, close our parenthesis, and we've got a formula that works. Let's do that again. So equals PV, our rate is 0.08, comma, the number of periods here is 2. So we highlight cell A14 and pick it up as a formula. Our payment is 0 because we have no even payments going on here. We put another comma in. Our future value, which needs to go in as a negative number, is a negative, and then we highlight the cell for year's two's, year two's payment and just close our parenthesis and we find out that the present value of $15,000 received in two years is 12860 assuming an 8% interest rate. Let's go ahead and do that again equals PV parenthesis our rate is 0.08 our number of periods is 3 comma our payment is 0 and our future value is a negative sign and we pick up cell C15, close parenthesis, and finally, now, we've built a formula that is references two cells over and one cell over. So we should be able to copy that down and make it work for everything else, and it does. So that's very nice, but if you're not sure whether or not you've built your formula right, just do it line by line or row by row to make sure you've got it right. So let's sum that up. We're going to go to Auto Sum. It's highlighting the five rows above it, it knows what I want to uh, add up together. 
It anticipates that. I hit return and it tells me that the present value of this stream of cash flows is 76789 So if we get a chance to talk to Aunt Mabel, we're going to tell her that we would rather have $20,000 a year for five years than this payment schedule of 10, 15, 20, 25, and $30,000 a year because the present value is slightly higher at 79, almost $80,000 compared to 76, $77,000. And that should do ya for the present value of a stream of pain.